The kernel power event 41 error is one of the common problems in both Windows 10 and 11. This error happens when the computer shuts down or restarts without being told to. There are usually a few reasons why this happens. In this video, we'll show you how to fix this problem. Make sure to do these first steps before trying any of the troubleshooting steps. Make sure that all of the power cables, including the ones that go from the power supply to the motherboard and GPU, are in place and tight. Try changing the cable between the power supply and the wall socket. You should also use a different plug to connect the computer to the wall. Try swapping out any UPS, surge protectors, extension cords, or multi-plugs. Take out any extra drives, USB devices, other than the keyboard and mouse, and anything else that is drawing power from the computer that isn't essential. Do not overclock. If none of these things has done anything, then here are the steps that you should do. By the way, please like and share our videos to help those who might have the same issues so that we can help them too. Once you're done, then let's begin. First, use maximum performance for your power settings. Given that this is an issue with power, you should make sure that the computer's power level is optimized for maximum performance. Click on the Start button. Click on Settings. Click on System. Click on Power and Sleep. Click on Additional Power Settings. On the preferred plans, choose High Performance. Click on Change Plan Settings. Make sure to choose Never on the drop-down box of Put the Computer to Sleep. This prevents the computer from sleeping. Click on Change Advanced Power Settings. This will open the Power Options window. Locate Hard Disk and set Turn Off Hard Disk after 0 minutes. Click Apply then OK. Next, disable fast startup. This problem can sometimes happen because the computer is set to start up quickly. If you turn it on, your computer will start up faster. One bad thing about this is that the computer won't shut down completely, which is usually necessary after a new update. Click on the start button. Click on settings. Click on system. Click on power and sleep. Click on Choose what the power buttons do. Click on Change settings that are currently unavailable. Uncheck the box for Turn on Fast Startup. Click on Save Changes. Next, install Windows Updates. Make sure your computer is running the most recent Windows 10 update to rule out the possibility that the problem is caused by a bug in the software. Click on Start. Click on Settings. Click on Update and Security. Click on Check for Updates. Wait for the updates to be downloaded and applied. After that, restart the computer. Then, install Windows Updates. Lastly, use the Power Troubleshooter. Use the Windows 10 Troubleshooter tool as a last step to try to fix the problem. This is a built-in tool that can find and fix most of your system's common problems. Click on Start. Click on Settings. Click on Update and Security. Click on Troubleshoot. This can be found on the left pane. Click on Tower. This can be found on the right pane under the Find and Fix Other Problems section. Click on Run the Troubleshooter. Apply the fix that the system recommends. That's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it. If you can leave a like or comment, subscribe to our channel or share this video to your friends. This can greatly help in making Google's algorithm can find and recommend this video to others. 